Hi, welcome to Miso Hungry. Today we're going to make egg rolls. So now the mushrooms are soaked and they softened up and got a little bit bigger. These are shredded mushrooms, uh, black, um, black, and then dried and shredded. So now, so now, I'm just gonna chop it up in little pieces like that. Bean sprout, mung bean sprout. Uh, you can use any type of bean sprout. This is the best one to use for the egg rolls. But if you can't find any bean sprout, you can also use alfalfa sprout. Or you can just skip it all together. Vermicelli mung bean noodles, also known as glass noodles. Soak in water. Put three of them in. Mung bean noodles are also known as vermicelli noodles. Um, make sure you put enough water to cover the top and let it soak for about 10 minutes in lukewarm water. Okay, here I have a really big carrot, which is easy, because if you have one of these shredders, you can easily peel it and then shred it. You can do it like this. Or, if you don't have this shredder, you can score it and then slice it. And then just keep turning it. Keep turning until all the sides are scored. And then you can see you guide your finger and just slice it down. You guide the carrot with your finger. I'm sorry, guide the knife with your finger and slice. See, I'll have little shreds like this. The shreds are coming out like this. After you're done shredding the carrot, just chop it in half, or a couple times. Just roughly chop it so that when you roll it up, it'll be easier. The noodles are soaked long enough so they're softer, as you can see. So you want to put them on a cutting board. They're really long, so just put it on the cutting board long ways, like that. And then just chop it three times. Just so it's not too long when you mix it up with the other mixture. Hmm? 